Hi, this is Ravi Singh and welcome to another episode of Ravi Singh Blog.in and today in this video I'm going to talk about how to create ebook from your blog post. I'm also going to talk about designer. This is an online tool to create attractive ebook from your blog post or your website. It can even create ebook from your Facebook comment or Facebook post. So this is a very interesting tool. I'm, I will also discuss why ebook is important for every blogger or digital marketer and how you can use designer to gain more traffic and email subscriber for your blog. So let's get started. So first of all, the question arises is why you need ebook? Yes, as a blogger, you need ebook to gather more email subscriber to your blog. How you can do it is you can use ebook as your lead magnet. When I say lead magnet, it means it can be used to attract email lead to get sub to get them subscribed to your blog. So for example, if you are a blogger who is offering a blogging tips, you can say something like I'm offering this, uh, you know, 20 free tips on how to gather more traffic to your blog or how to get more email subscriber to your blog or how to get people engaged to your blog. So something like that PDF book, people will be interested to download because they want to read it. They want to gain subscriber. So they will use their email ID to subscribe to your blog and there you will get more email subscriber. So ebook can be used to gain more email subscriber. The second benefit of ebook is you can also sell it on Amazon and site like Kindle to get more revenue. So people use that as a blogger or digital marketer, they sell their books and they, they are generating good money. You can keep something like $5 or $10 per download for the book and you can earn a very good extra revenue from your blog. Now you can also use your ebook to repurpose your content. So what happened is suppose you are creating a blog post on your blog, but at the same time you will create an ebook or PDF from that blog post and you can upload it to different sites. For example, SlideShare, there are other PDF sharing sites where you can upload it and then you can get more traffic uh, to your blog from these sites. So uh, an ebook is very important for blogger to repurpose your content and gain more traffic. Now let's see what is the problem. The, the problem with the ebook is we don't know how to create attractive ebook. Now we can just make a PDF, you know, copy of the book, but that will not sell. So you need a tool which can create attractive ebook and you don't want to spend too much time on creating an ebook because you know people are there are uh, professional people who create ebooks they take a lot of time you don't have that much time to create pdf so you need a tool which can do all all these things on your behalf and there comes the designer so as i said there are two biggest problem with the ebook the designing and the creating the creating of the ebook is writing the whole content by yourself and that is going to take more time and the second thing is the designing. So creating a font, a header and footer, a table of contents and call to action. There are a lot of things you need to insert in your ebook and that is going to take a lot of time. So do we have any tool which can do that for you? Yes, we have designer. So let me introduce designer. This is an online tool to create beautiful ebook using your web page or your blog post. So you already have a blog post with you. Now you want to repurpose or create a PDF with that. Yes, you have the designer. It will also remove, you know, the, the things which are cluttering your page, like, for example, the sh social share button or menus or related posts. There are a lot of things in your blog post. So it will remove all those things and keep only the content. And it will automatically, you know, make the header, uh, highlight the portion of the uh, pages. So you don't have to work again on the content. So there are a lot of background things which design can do by themselves. I'm going to show you a demo and there I will describe how exactly it is done. Of course, you can add header, footer, images, call to action. If you want to add something in your PDF on top of the content of your blog post, you can also do that. So they have the component which you can insert in the PDF and can make it very attractive. All that I'm going to show that in the demo. Now, before I will show you the demo of the uh, designer, let me tell you how exactly we can create the ebook. The step number one is you need to get the URL of the web page or the blog post which you want to convert. And it's not that you can use only one blog post URL. You can use multiple, for example, two or three. Then you'll 
select the template so designer had lot of predefined templates for example they have a you know different kind of like if you are presenting something or you are creating an ebook for tutorial so they have a different template you can select which template works fine for you and then once you do that it will automatically remove and add component for example uh, there are uh, you know the social sharing buttons and all those things which are there on blog post it will remove that and then on top of that you will customize for example you want to choose a text a font a color whatever you want to change you can do that and then after that the last stage is to download the pdf copy of the book you can also download it in the format which kindle support so all those options are available in designer so it's time to see the demo of the designer so let me go to the designer web page or designer dashboard and then i will show you how exactly in minutes you can create a pdf copy of your blog post okay so now let's see how we can create an ebook using designer so the first step is you need to get the url in which you want to import the content so to do that I'm in this demo I'm going to use the URL option to create the PDF but you have different option like Facebook or you know uh, some other way like if you have created something in the MS Word you can also use that so here I'm going to give uh, create a new project and I'm going to name it as uh, my first ebook and uh, I will choose the option import from URL you have also option import from pdf so if you already have a pdf you can edit it and you know uh, create a new content hold together now here in the url option i will put my url here and then click the option as import so once you do that designer will try to import the content of that url into the pdf it will take some time uh, depending on your uh, you know length of the con content and then it will import and now here here after that you need to select which type of template you want you can just go through the uh, you know content they have given it as a city name but for example here i will select as a new york and then i will click on the next so scroll down and click on the next then click on the next once you do that see what happened it created a whole new ebook which looked very professional and you see my picture which is which was there on the blog post was imported and now see the how beautifully they already customized the content so there are still few things which you need to modify for example here uh, i need to you know just remove the more option so i will just click on this and click on this remove option it will go away so you can see there are a lot of different thing uh, mentioned here and of course this footer was i have selected in during the creation of the pdf so that's what is there so you can see here uh, it's it's so easy to create you don't have to spend too much time and the book looks so professional you can see all your links also which you have used in the post was all intact now this is what designer do for you now if you are not happy with this you can of course go ahead and you know modify or add something new to that so let me explain the component which is available with designer so if you can see on the left hand side once you click on the elements you can see the component section where you have option to write a new article cover page if you want to create a new cover page call to action this is a very nice quality and let me show you how exactly this work because this is very important for every blogger let me drop it here mm -hmm. okay let me do it at the bottom here i will go to the element and then so if you can see this is very nice call to action so when you create a pdf and you want user to take some action at the end of the post or maybe at the beginning of the content you can put something like that there is a button also you can give some link to that so you can see how easy it is to create an ebook quickly and beautifully and then you know uh, add some component on top of that for example call to action let me show you some more component which you can use now here there is a section called media so you can add different kind of images also if you want to add to your pdf which is very important that uh, pdf should have some good images so you can have different option for example a single image or maybe you know grid with 
four images. So there are a lot of options available. Then you have a typography. If you want to add something like, you know, a link, a label, a paragraph, something which is not there already in the blog post or uh, in the ebook, you can add it here. So for example, suppose I want to add a headline here. So you just need to drag it here. So <clears throat> something like take action here. So if you want to add anything to your existing PDF or you are not happy, there are a lot of component available where you can make it, you know, very interesting. Of course, after doing that, if you want to change something in the uh, like color, font, anything you can change in the PDF. So it will give you more flexibility. Either you can use the existing content or you can, you know, uh, change it if you are not happy with the uh, template already given by designer. So now, now let me show you how Facebook component can be added to it. So uh, if you see on the left hand side, if you select element, we have a Facebook. So in the Facebook, if you want to select anything like a Facebook post, a Facebook comment or Facebook, you know, comment image, whatever it is, you can just import it using the Facebook API. So even the Facebook integration is there where suppose you have a group where, you know, 10, 20 people are sharing some thoughts on that. So you can put all those comments in a PDF and can also give it to your user. So you can see uh, how easy it is to create a designer quickly for your customer or your readers and even sell it or distribute it and get more email subscriber. So now let, let me go back to the slides and explain some more important and the conclusion point. Uh, so let's go to the next slide. So you have just seen the demo of the designer. Let me explain some basic feature of the designer once again to, you know, refresh yourself. So of course, using designer, you can gather multiple pages and blog posts and create the ebook. Of course, it saves your time because you have already a lot of template available in designer, which can quickly create the ebook along with the font, color, header and footer. So it's very quick. Now, if you want to use free images in your blog post or in your PDF from your blog post, so there are a million images, free images are available in uh, Designer. Uh, they are using Pixabay and some other sites. So you don't have to go somewhere else and then, you know, import the images in your uh, ebook. You can directly use Designer to get those images. Now, the support is very nice in Designer. They have tons of video tutorials available to help you to understand. How designer works and also their support if you are facing any issue the designers say like uh, you are stuck somewhere while creating the PDF you can always you know contact their support now this is the quickest and the easiest way till now I found on internet to create an ebook so I would love to know your experience how you feel uh, about designer so please do write to me uh, the prices and all I have mentioned in my slides so you can see here it cost around $27 for the basic package and it will go till $67 for the agency package but for a newbie $27 per month is a very nice option where you'll get a 14 days free trial along with that 30 days money back guarantee so if you're not happy you can go ahead and return it and uh, the basic package contain uh, only the, uh, you know, import up to three blog posts or web pages. So that's the limitation. But as you go further, you will have more option. Of course, I've given the link for the designer below in my video description. Please go ahead and try it. It's risk free for 14 days and 30 days money back uh, guarantee. So you don't have to worry about that. And it is useful for all the bloggers, digital, digital marketer, and even all the product owner who try to sell some of their product and they need more email subscriber and traffic. So the conclusion is uh, till now, whatever I've seen on the internet designer is so far the best tool to create the ebook and creating an ebook is very important for designer. First of all, it gives you more email subscribers so you can use it as a lead magnet. Second thing is the traffic. So you can repurpose your article using PDF and then get more traffic. And the third thing is, as a blogger or as a product owner, you can also create PDF, uh, upload it on Amazon and can sell it. For example, $5, $10, you can create some ebook and sell it and can gain extra revenue for your blog. So I hope this little tutorial helped you to understand how designer works. 
I would love to see comments from you. So use the video comment section to you know post your uh, thoughts on that and uh, whether a uh, designer can help you to create PDF easily or not. I would love to hear from you. And as usual, if you need any help with designer, I'm here. Just use the contact us page of my blog, ravisingblog.in or you can also use the comment section to post your thoughts or questions. And also, please do not forget to share, subscribe and comment to this video. And if you like this video, please go ahead and click on the subscribe button. Thank you very much for listening to me.